me, Flippy, and welcome to my Halloween party. <laughs> well, I love Halloween. It's so fun and spooky. <laughs> and it's one of my favorite holidays because of all the pumpkins. <laughs> yeah, pumpkins. They're the color orange. One of my favorite colors. <laughs> well, we have some really amazing decorations here. Come on. We have pumpkins. Ooh. And a little ghost. Boo. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> so spooky. Goodbye. <laughs> Whoa. And look at what it is. It's a spider. <laughs> kind of creepy. Bye-bye. <laughs> Whoa. And some spooky and tasty marshmallows. <laughs> Ooh, they look really scary. <laughs> hey, do you know what this is? Yeah, this is a jack-o'-lantern. <laughs> That's when someone carves a scary or goofy-looking face on a pumpkin. <laughs> Ooh, I like jack-o'-lanterns. Well, it looks like we have everything or almost everything we need for our Halloween party. But it's not done yet. I almost forgot. I found something the other day that will help us finish the Halloween party. I'll be right back. Look at what it is. It's a book of spooky spells. Whoa. <laughs> hey, maybe if we read one of these spells, it will help us get everything we need for a really amazing Halloween party. Okay, let's read one of them. Hmm, which one should we read first? Ooh, what about the sweetest spell? <laughs> that one sounds really yummy. Okay, here we go. The sweetest spell, warm and sweet, crumbly or gooey, fresh from an oven, all crispy or chewy, flour, sugar, and chocolatey yummy, off the tray and into my tummy. Whoa. Look at where we are. <laughs> I bet this place will surely have a sweet treat for our Halloween party. <laughs> we just have to find something. Come on. Look at this, some tasty candy. Hmm, there's licorice, ooh, <laughs> and gummy butterflies. <laughs> Those sound so tasty, but it's a Halloween party. Maybe we should find something a little spookier. <laughs> hmm, let's keep looking, fun. Whoa, look at this. I bet one of these will be a perfect treat for the Halloween party. <laughs> And there's a person. Hello, it's me, Flippy. What's your name? Hi, Flippy. I'm Joan, oh. the owner of Jones on Third. It's nice to meet you, Joan. Nice to meet you. Wow, these treats look amazing. Did you make all of these? Yes, I did. Whoa. <laughs> well, I'm looking for a really tasty treat for my Halloween party. Do you think one of these will work? I think, well, I definitely think something will work here. We have so a lot of Halloween Whoa. cookies. There's cupcakes. Mm. <laughs> they have really cool designs. Yeah. And we have a cupcake with a little bat. <laughs> and a cupcake with a ghost. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> That's really spooky. And we have a cupcake with a jack-o'-lantern. Mm. Hello. <laughs> Whoa. And look at this cupcake. Joan, what flavor is this cupcake? That's a red velvet cupcake. Red velvet, mmm. This looks so tasty. Maybe it will work for the Halloween party. Let's give it a taste. <sighs> oh, that is so tasty. Joan, can you think of something that I could share at my Halloween party? I can. I think you should share the Halloween, the, the ghost cookies. Ghost cookies? 
spooky, and delicious. <laughs> that would be perfect. Perfect. Mm. But John, uh, how do you make a ghost cookie? Well, first you make the cookie, and then you decorate. You put the white frosting. Would you like to try it? Yeah. We have white frosting and some little cookies. <laughs> Okay, I'll, I'll right. watch you first. You're going to watch me. All right, I'll do it first. Whoa, that is so cool. Joan's spreading the frosting all over the top of the cookie. So it doesn't look like a cookie. It looks like a ghost. And then we can Ooh. put eyes on it. We can put, there you go. Let's see Whoa. you make one. Yeah. Well, once we put the frosting on, we get to put eyes on it. Ooh. Really spooky. <laughs> we have small eyes, really small. We have medium eyes, and we have giant eyes. <laughs> okay, but first we have to put some icing on. So, well, grab. Some. See you do one. Okay, some there icing. There you go. Perfect. And we're gonna spread it all around the cookie. <laughs> Oh, thanks, Joan. This is fun. Whoa. You're doing a great job. <laughs> it's a little messy. <laughs> a little bit. A little bit. <laughs> well, just need a little more practice, and then I'll be as good as Joan. <laughs> okay, so I'll put mine right here. That's a good idea. Okay, so now let's put some eyes on the ghost cookies. I think we should pretend that we did these before, and then we can put the eyes on there. Yeah. We'll pretend now, we iced these cookies, and let's put some eyes on them, just like this. Are you ready? Look. Uh oh. Uh oh. They fell off my cookie. Hmm. Hmm. Joan, do you know how to keep the eyes on the cookie? I do. We have some frosting here, and we put a little frosting, and then you can put the eyes on that frosting. Whoa. So we take the eyes and we put a little dot of frosting, and then you just press it down so they stick on. Frosting, it's like glue you can eat. <laughs> That's right, and I'm gonna yeah. do the little, the medium size. Whoa. So you have two choices for your, for, for your party. Wow, those look so fun. We have a ghost with really big eyes. Woo! And look. Joan made a really cool ghost with medium eyes. Ooh. <laughs> well, these look beautiful, but hmm, I think they're missing something. Hey, sprinkles. We have orange sprinkles and black sprinkles and orange and black sprinkles. <laughs> Can we decorate the cookies with this? Yes, we can. I'll put a little more of that icing glue on there. Ooh. And then you can decorate them with the sprinkles. Okay. Well, one of my favorite colors is the color orange, so I'm gonna put some orange sprinkles. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Ooh. That looks really great for a Halloween party. And then you can decorate this one. Yeah, let's do black and orange for Jones. Whoa, <laughs> it's <Perfect>. raining sprinkles. <laughs> and you can also cover this, that all with sprinkles if you want. Yeah, <laughs> look, this is one of the ghosts that we covered earlier. We can cover it entirely with sprinkles. Whoa, <laughs> so, so much fun. And a little messy, <laughs> that's okay. We'll clean up afterwards. Well, I think these ghosts will be perfect for my party. Now, we just need to put them in my cookie jar. <laughs> will you give me a hand? I would love to help you. Okay. <laughs> I can't wait till we get back to the campfire and have a party with all these sweet treats. <laughs> well, there you go. Okay. I think we have all the ghost cookies we'll need. <laughs> Well, thank you for showing us how to make them. Well, thank you. That was a lot of fun. <laughs> I had a lot of fun, too. <laughs> well, Joan, I should probably be getting back. All right. I'm sorry to see you go. <laughs> but I'll see you soon. All right. Okay. Let's read another spell to get back. Here we go. Back, back, back we go. On to the next 
and on with the show! Where did he go? Well... Making ghost cookies with you was so much fun. <laughs> we sure need a sweet treat for this Halloween party. <laughs> hey, I'll set these cookies over here for later. <laughs> Whoa, speaking of ghost cookies, <laughs> look at this over here. Whoa, look at it. This is a ghost jack-o'-lantern. <laughs> this ghost looks really happy. <laughs> Wait a minute. This ghost jack-o'-lantern wasn't here before. Spooky. <laughs> hey, I have an idea. Why don't we read another spell so we can get everything we need for the Halloween party? <laughs> okay, let's see what spell we should read next. Hmm. Ooh, the costume charm. It goes like this. A needle and thread, some plastic or string, will be able to turn Blippi into anything. Off to someone who knows how to sew, a disguise we will make, away we go! Whoa! Where'd we go? Hm. Wonder what this place is. Oh, there's so many cool things here. Some colorful t-shirts? Ooh! <laughs> Oh, and look at this coat rack. There are some bags and a lot of fabric. It's very colorful. <laughs> this fabric is blue and white. <laughs> Whoa, and look, there are some hats. One hat <laughs> or one, two hats. Woo! <laughs> This is pretty silly. Whoa, and look, there's a spooky mask. Woo! <laughs> hey, maybe this mask would be really fun to add to the Halloween party. <laughs> maybe we can find something even spookier. <laughs> Whoa, and look, there are some people here. <laughs> Let's go say hi. Hi, it's me, Blippi. What are your names? Hi. I'm a costume designer. <laughs> it's nice to meet you. <laughs> hey, Blippi, I'm Sean. I'm an actor, and I'm actually getting fitted for a pilot costume. Oh, hi, Sean. That sounds so cool. Whoa, what's that fitting, though? Well, I'm taking Sean's measurements so I can find out what size he is so I know how big or small to make the costume. Oh, that is so cool. Sean's getting fit for his costume. Maybe Brittany can help me find a costume for the Halloween party. <laughs> that would be so cool. <laughs> hey, Brittany, I'm looking for a costume for my Halloween party. Do you think you could help me find one? I sure can. What I do. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm so excited to have a costume. <laughs> all right, Sean, you're all set. I'll see you on set. All right, thanks, Brittany. Have a good party, Blippi. Oh, bye, Sean. <laughs> okay. I'm so excited for a costume, but I don't know what to wear. Well... I have some ideas. Should we try some things on first? Yeah, that's a great idea. We can try on some different costumes and see which one is the best. <laughs> okay, first, I think you would look great as a scientist. Ooh. <laughs> I'm so excited to be Scientist Blippi. Whoa, look at this really big white lab coat and some safety goggles. Hmm. Whoa! Whoa! Here we go! Scientist Blippi! Oh, we can do so many experiments! Ooh. <laughs> mm. Well, this is a fun costume, but maybe we need something different for the Halloween party. How about a magician? Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Look at this! It's a really big black cape with a hood and purple lining. I feel really spooky! Whoa! Maybe too spooky. 
Hmm, I like this costume, but maybe we should try something that's a not less scary. Yeah, that's a little too spooky. <laughs> How about a construction worker? Oh, construction workers! <laughs> They're so cool. Yeah, especially with their safety vests. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so ready to build some things. We can build a house or a bridge. <laughs> there are so many possibilities. Mm, but this, this safety vest is pretty big on me. So maybe we find a costume that fits a little bit better. <laughs> this one's too big. Hmm. I wonder what we'll try on next. Sometimes you try on something and it doesn't fit or it's not right. But that's okay. You just keep on trying till you have the perfect costume. <laughs> okay. Over Whoa. there. Here we go. Brown <gasps> It's an apron. Hmm. Do you know what I'm dressing up as? Wait, one more thing. Apron and a hat. <laughs> that's right. I'm Chef Blippi. <laughs> I'm ready to cook up some tasty treats. Maybe we can bake a cake or yummy cookies mm. or the most amazing dinner. <laughs> I'm getting really hungry after all this talk about food. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't dress up as a chef. I'll be too hungry. <laughs> Everywhere I go, I want to eat everything. <laughs> I think we can find an even better costume. Thanks, Brittany, but those costumes weren't quite right. Hmm. You know what? I have an idea. I've been working on something new, and I think it'll be just perfect. How do you feel about a fireman? <gasps> a firefighter would be perfect! <laughs> yeah! Oh, they fight fires, and even cooler, they drive Fire trucks! Yeah! <laughs> this is gonna be a great Halloween costume. I just have to finish it. I was sewing it and I'm almost done. Oh! Costume's not done yet. So, Brittany's gonna finish it for me. <laughs> Thanks, Brittany. Whoa! What are you doing here? Well, I pinned the fabric in place so that it doesn't move around while I'm sewing it. Whoa, that is so cool. Do you see this right here? Hmm, this is a pin cushion with lots of pins. Yep, sharp. Ooh, yeah, pins are really sharp. Here's another pin. Thank you. So, because they're so sharp, we put them in a pin cushion. So you can, you can get them really easy and not hook yourself in the finger. Mm, that would not be fun. <laughs> Whoa, and look at this. Yeah, these are spools of thread. <laughs> and they're all different colors. This is what Brittany's going to use to finish the costume. <laughs> Whoa. Look at how many colors there are. We have red <laughs> and a blue spool. Ooh. <laughs> hey, it's my favorite color, orange. <laughs> orange and blue. <Ooh. laughs> and Purple! Whoa! There are so many cool threads. Hmm. Whoa! And look! The spools of threads go on the sewing machine! <laughs> uh, Brittany, what's a sewing machine? Well, it's a machine that you put thread into and it stitches your clothes together so that you don't have to do it by hand. Whoa! It's faster and it's stronger. <laughs> yeah, do you see? The sewing machine has a spool of thread like the colorful ones just looked at. And the thread goes through the sewing machine and into the needle at the bottom. And now that Brittany's pinned up the costume, we get to watch her sew it. <laughs> Let's look. <laughs> That's amazing. The needle is moving so fast and it's putting the thread in the clothes. Look at it go! <laughs> Brittany is really good at sewing. <laughs> All right, just about finished. Let me get these 
pokies out so they don't poke you when you put it on. <laughs> don't want to get poked. <laughs> Turn the right side out. I am so excited to be a firefighter. This is gonna be the best. <laughs> okay. Okay, here we go. One arm and two arms. <laughs> Whoa! It fits perfectly. Wow. <laughs> and well, you look great. I think I need my firefighter hat. This is the best costume ever! I'm so ready to put out fires! Whoa! Water hose! <laughs> and ride the fire truck! Whoa! <laughs> this is gonna be a perfect costume for the Halloween party! <laughs> Thank you so much, Brittany! Wait, don't forget your pants! Oh, okay. Don't wanna forget those. Here we go. And jacket, pants, and firefighter hat or helmet. <laughs> well, this was so much fun. Thanks for showing me how to sew and giving me the best costume ever. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. Have a great Halloween party. I'll see you later, Brittany. We better be getting back to the Halloween party. And I think we should read another spell. Maybe it'll take us back. Here we go. Back, back, back we go. On to the next, and on with the show! Libby? <laughs> Whoa! That was so much fun learning how to sew. And good thing we got our costume. <laughs> We're definitely going to need a costume for our Halloween party. And I'm so excited to be a firefighter. I'm going to put it down over here. Can't wait to dress up later. Whoa, and look at this. It's a jack-o'-lantern with fire on it. <laughs> yeah, because I'm going to be a firefighter. Wait a minute. This jack-o'-lantern wasn't here before. Hmm. Double spooky. <laughs> well, we've gotten so many fun and amazing things for our Halloween party. Maybe we should read another spell to get even more amazing things. Okay, here we go. Time to read another spell. Ooh, <laughs> this one's called Poof Poof Pumpkin. A fruit, not a veggie. Your favorite color, orange. We carve them and light them. Nothing rhymes with orange. Take me now to another place to learn how to give them a silly old face. Whoa. Look at where we are. <laughs> Whoa. And look at what it is. <laughs> Do you know what these are? <laughs> yeah, these are pumpkins. Ooh, <laughs> and these pumpkins are so cool looking. They're really bumpy. <laughs> and these pumpkins are my favorite color. Yeah, the color orange. <laughs> hey, and I see a person. I wonder what they're doing. <laughs> Hello, I'm Blippi. What's your name? Hi, Blippi. I'm John, and I'm a master pumpkin carver. Whoa, a master pumpkin carver? Oh, that's why the pumpkins are here. Pumpkins, pumpkin carver, pumpkin spell. <laughs> Making a lot of sense. Well, how do you carve a pumpkin? Well, I'd like to show you. Okay, let's carve a pumpkin. <laughs> Excellent. Well, what I'd like you to do is, would you like to draw a face on the pumpkin? Yeah, that would be so fun. So the first step you need to do, draw a face. That's right. Here's a marker, and I'd like you to draw a face on the other side. Okay. Let's see. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna draw a face. So first, we need to draw, hmm, some eyes. <laughs> and I think we should draw some really silly eyes that are triangles. Yeah, triangles. 
with three sides. One, two, three. <laughs> we drew one triangle, and I think our pumpkin needs another eye. So. Two triangles. And, hmm, what else should we draw on our pumpkin? Hmm, <laughs> I know, it needs a mouth. <laughs> okay, so let's draw half a circle or a semicircle for the mouth. Okay. Whoa. John, how does that face look? That looks pretty good. All right, so the next thing that I think we should do is cut out the back side. Oh, we get to cut out the pumpkin? That's right, we're gonna open up the back side and we're going to take out the seeds. Would you like to help me with that? <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's great. Okay. Okay. We're gonna turn this pumpkin around and we have to hollow it out. Yeah. We have to take all the stuff and seeds on the inside and take them on the outside. <laughs> That's right. So I'm gonna cut a big hole here. Okay. So I can start it and if you want, you can finish it. Yeah, that sounds really good. Okay. And remember, if you're gonna use a knife, make sure you have a professional to help or a grown up. <laughs> okay. Okay, so I'm gonna make a nice big hole here. Whoa. On the back side. You want to open it up? Yeah. How do I open it up? Just pull, pull it, it out. Pull it all out. Okay. Here we go. Open sesame. Whoa! Ooh. <laughs> Whoa! It's so spooky looking. Yeah. Look at that. This is the inside of a pumpkin. <laughs> There's all these little pumpkin seeds. Whoa! 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 <laughs> Okay, so how are we gonna scoop this out, John? Well, I have a special trick. So I take a CD and you can use the CD on the inside and actually scrape it out. You wanna give it a shot? Yeah, okay. Wow, look at it. How many seeds do you think we have in there? Okay, let's count the seeds. One seed, two seeds, Three seeds. Uh-oh, maybe we can't count all the seeds. <laughs> There's a lot in there. <laughs> well, um, we can't count the seeds, but it sure looks like there's a lot of them. So now what do we do next? Okay, so let's turn the pumpkin around and we're gonna cut out the eyes. Maybe you can help me um, cut the triangles out. Would you be yeah. able to do that? <laughs> yeah, that would be so fun. Oh, that's great. Okay. Okay, here we go. Okay, let's see if it works. Hmm, almost. We're gonna push. Is it gonna go in? Oh, <laughs> whoa, look at it. Good job. Okay, we finished one eye, and now the second eye. <laughs> So I've got another little trick. So you see how we've got those lines left over from using our magic marker? Mm -hmm. So we can spray a little bit of alcohol on there and then take a paper towel, just wipe off our line. Whoa. Like that. Whoa, it disappears. Push one of the eyes in, maybe we'll push the mouth out. Okay, here we go. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! That was really silly. <laughs> we did it. We have two eyes and one mouth. I like to use potatoes and carrots with, with my carvings. Whoa! Yeah. <laughs> That's gonna and, be so fun. And so this is a russet potato. Okay. and it's white on the inside. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take 
How'd you know? <laughs> I, Lucky I, guess. <laughs> I took an ice cream scooper and I changed it. I took out the little mechanism that drops out ice cream. Mm -hmm. And now we're going to use it to scoop out potatoes. Oh, okay. Can you show us how to do that? I'd love to. So look, it's a round ball. What do you think we could use this for? Hmm, what do you think? We have a jack-o'-lantern and pumpkin that we're carving up. Hmm. I have an idea. <gasps> Eyes! <laughs> That's, That's a right. great idea. Okay. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this little tool that I have, and I've made it sharp on this side. And I'm okay. gonna push it right through like this. Oh. Look, so now we've got a hole. So what do you think we should put with that hole? What's that going to be? Hmm. I <laughs> am not sure. <laughs> but I think it would be really cool if we could put a different color so it looks like the color in your eye. Yeah, this will be the white part of your eye, and the inside will be the colored part. <laughs> so I've got a couple of carrots here. So what do you think? What should we use? Yeah, those are really cool carrots. What if we use the, the darker purple colored carrot? <laughs> I love that idea. Okay, so this is a little trickier because this is a, you know, carrots are really crunchy, so they're not that soft. So I'm gonna just work this tool all the way through. So now I'm gonna take this and push it out of here. Look at this, isn't that neat? Ooh. So the center was yellow, but look how pretty that is. Yeah, look at this. We cut a cylinder out of the purple carrot. The outside of the carrot is the color purple, <laughs> but the inside is the color yellow. What? <laughs> that is so beautiful. Look at it. There's all different lines coming out of it. I think this would be really cool to put in our jack-o'-lantern. <laughs> okay, so we'll take this part, and what do we do next? Okay, now the next thing that I like to do is I just trim a little bit off of both sides. I wanna put the pupil in. Okay. Do you know what your pupil is? Is that the little part of your eye? Yeah, the pupil, the little part of your eye. <laughs> right in the center. So we have our carrot and our potato. <laughs> We're gonna put it inside. Whoa, and look, it looks just like an eye. A really big eye. <laughs> hey, what if we put some eyes on our pumpkin? So we have these two eyes, but I, I before we put the eyes in, mm -hmm. I'd like us to put the teeth in. Would you help me with that? Yeah, so first, before we put in the eyes, we're gonna put in some funny teeth. <laughs> We're gonna use this side for the tooth. Yes. We take a toothpick, put it in the potato, and then we put it in the mouth. <laughs> so, John, do I just put it anywhere I want? Try put it, yeah, anywhere in the mouth, wherever you think it needs a tooth. And I'll make another <laughs> one for you and, and you can put it in there. Oh, look at it. It has one tooth. Here's another one. And we're gonna give him two teeth. <laughs> two teeth? And we'll do one more. We'll give him some more teeth. Okay. Try this one. Whoa! <laughs> See if that one works. You tell me, if is that enough teeth or do you want more? Mm. I have one more. I, I think we can do, I think this is good. We don't need a lot of teeth in our jack-o'-lantern because he's gonna look really silly. <laughs> well, great. Okay, so I have one thing that I need to do to the inside. Okay. So would you mind turning the pumpkin around for me? Yes. Yeah. So let's scoop. And now, there are the eyeballs. We put in the eyes. <laughs> okay, let me grab some of the insides away. And put in one eye and two eyes. <laughs> Whoa, 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 the eyes are going crazy. <laughs> That's because we need to put them in there with some toothpicks. Yeah, toothpicks will make sure that they don't fall out or go really silly. Woo, woo, woo. <laughs> Hi, 
This pumpkin has a lot of personality. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. Well, we have our pumpkin. That's it. Should we close the close the pumpkin all the way back up? <laughs> let's do it. Whoops, head upside down. Okay. <laughs> right, let's yeah. pin that closed. And when you put the back in, then you use toothpicks to make sure it stays closed. And then you're all done with the pumpkin. <laughs> but John, I think there's one thing we need to do. Give it a name. Okay. Hmm. Let's name this jack-o'-lantern Jack. <laughs> Jack the jack-o'-lantern. Well, thanks so much for teaching us how to carve a pumpkin. You're welcome. That was a lot of fun today. <laughs> well, I'll see you later. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> well, we better be getting back. That was so much fun. Hmm. Let's see. Maybe this return spell will help. Back, back, back we go. On to the next. And on with the show! Whoa! We're back! <laughs> Who knew you could make a jack-o'-lantern look so cool? <laughs> oh, and look at this! It's another jack-o'-lantern. This one looks really familiar. Hmm. Triple spooky. <laughs> <laughs> well, it looks like we have everything we need for a Halloween party. A sweet treat, a really cool costume, and jack-o'-lanterns. <laughs> I think it's time to read one last spell. Okay. Here we go. The cookies were delicious. The costume is neat. And carving those pumpkins was a spooky fun treat. Jack O'Lantern friends, it's Halloween night. Goodbye to the dark. Let there be light. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> that was so cool. Look, I'm all dressed up as a firefighter. Whoa! All these jack-o'-lanterns look amazing. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> they all look so beautiful. <laughs> and it looks like we have everything we need for an awesome Halloween party. <laughs> Welcome to my spooky, ooky Halloween party. <laughs> Ooh, spooky. Well, it's time to get in the Halloween spirit. Maybe this book of Halloween spells will help us out. <laughs> hey, you, you better beware. Cause Halloween's the time for a fright and a scare. You gotta stick real close to me right now. I'll take us all around to new places. Here's how. I've got a little brown book of spooky spells. Not the kind that you find off a normal bookshelf. These spells can teleport us to any place. So let's go make some cookies or carve a pumpkin face. Traveling round with the book of spells. Now we're baking lots of cookies. What a wonderful smell. We're picking a costume off of the rack. And we're carving a face for Pumpkin Jack. Traveling round with the book of spells. Now we're baking lots of cookies. What a wonderful smell. We're picking a costume off of the rack. And we're carving a face for Pumpkin Jack. So, you want to learn about the sweetest spell? We're going to a store where treats and goodies they sell. And bake. If we're lucky, we might even get to make a cookie or two or a big cupcake. Next up, we have to chant the costume charm. We need to find some clothes for our head and our legs and arms and then poof, poof, pumpkin. We're spinning and jumping, carving pumpkins for the party while the music is thumping. Traveling round with the book of spells. Now we're baking lots of cookies, what a wonderful smell. We're picking a costume off of the rack and we're carving a face for Pumpkin Jack. Traveling round with the book of spells. Now we're baking lots of cookies, what a wonderful smell. We're picking a costume off of the rack and we're carving a face for Pumpkin Jack. Thanks to our book of spells, this is going to be the spookiest, ookiest Halloween party ever. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Really great dancing. <laughs> I had so much fun with you today. Well, this is the end of this video, but if 
you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, will you spell my name with me? <laughs> yeah. Okay, here we go. P-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Flippy. Good job. <laughs> well, I'll see you real soon. Happy Halloween.